Oh my god. Yep. Yeah. Oh, so oh my god, that uh -huh. is so satisfying. Welcome back, you guys. Madeline Drew here, back at it again. If you guys watched the episode where we went to ColourPop previously, we're yes. in the same outfits because it's the same day. It's the same day. We just had lunch. <laughs> we we get to go back for another Michigas. I don't know. We're making another product. I'm so excited. Okay, so last time we made the peach palette. Right. So dope. But this time we get a sneak preview of a product that hasn't been released to the public yet. I don't know why they think we are the ones to trust this information We're with. like the chosen coveted ones. Oh yeah, the clue. It's in my lap and I forgot about it. Okay. The clue! For your under eyes only. Oh, that's cute. Like for your eyes only, but it's under your eye. Okay, or we making the puns. under eye it. concealer? Or just concealer? Probably, maybe. Under eyes, that makes sense to me. But I don't know, for, do you think we're making it again or do you think we're just like mm. checking it out? Well, yeah, hopefully we're testing it out. I would actually love to learn like how they make really good under eye concealer because that is a dream to right? know. Right? Let's do it. Let's go. All right. <laughs> Hey girl, we're Hi. back. Welcome we're back. back. We, we just had, had lunch. lunch. Yes. <laughs> okay. So, you guys ready, ready for round two? Yes. yes. Okay, so something really exciting for you guys. We're launching a brand new concealer. You called We it. thought so. You guys are the first ever to get a sneak peek at what we're launching. It's wow. a pretty fresh concealer, oh. and it's all about healthy, hydrated, and happy skin. 30 shades, it's full coverage, 30? it's long wearing. Oh my god, mm -hmm. that's There's a lot. There's a shade for everybody. Oh my gosh. Why are you guys Perfect. trusting us with this? Yeah, are we <laughs> the ones to know the secret information? Oh, but we know first because we're in the past, they're in the future, so it's available now. Yeah. That's true. By the time you guys are watching this, it's available. So that's you guys okay. want to make it? Wait, are we making all 30 shades? Uh, I think that might be a little, a little, oh a little much. But we could do your guys' of shades. Perfect. Okay, perfect. Okay. Let's do it. I get, I get excited. I just want to be Balance excited. ambitious. <laughs> We hear we're making concealer. Yes. Oh are you God. excited? Yes. <laughs> yes. I'm, I'm just happy you guys are trusting us to make something else. <gasps> Did you get that? I'm so sorry. True. I'm so sorry. Oh my God, I'm so fired. Okay, so last time our lab test accessory of choice was the hairnet, and this time we decided to go with the glasses because how cute, right? And once again, because we are, are only in the test lab, it's okay that we don't have the hairnets. It's okay that we're right. kind of loosely choosing these. Oh, these aren't getting oh, shipped oh. to you. So we're gonna walk you through how we make our concealer similar to how we did our palette. Cool. It's a brand new technology for us, brand new complexion line. Collectively as a team, we decided, you know, we need a full coverage, hydrating concealer, and Perfect. that's what we're gonna show you guys today. And let me tell you guys, it's really hard to build a complexion assortment. You have to match all these people, pull all these pigments, right. yeah. and it's fun, it's a process. Yeah, do you guys really like fun. have inspiration from people? Like how does that work? Or do you just kind of yeah. go down the color line? Like I don't know what that even means. We kind of like to make sure that we represent everybody in the office. Right. Mm -hmm. And as we're creating the shades, we're testing them on people to validate that they're working on the people that we want them to work on. Right. Ensuring that we have the same number of shades per skin tone category so that everybody's equally represented. Yeah. And it's just kind of trial and error. Complexion is, it's a tough one. Yeah. As, as Beyonce tough. says, there are complexities in complexion. Okay, so Drew, for you, I match you to Dark 180 Neutral. Okay, cool. And Madeline, I match you to Fair 20 Neutral. Love it. Melody, will you show us the first step? Yes. So here we are going to make an emulsion, and right here what we have mixing is our oil phase. That looks like how I make my matcha. <laughs> so we have our oils, we have our emulsifier in here, we have vitamin E, antioxidants. Wow. Vitamin e. for the skin. <gasps> wow. Oh my god. It, that's like spices. Wait, 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 wait. Break this down for me. So those are the different colors yes. it takes to make my shade? So when we're making concealer shades and foundation shades, we use four different pigments. We use white, black, red, and yellow. She's already pre-weighed three of your pigments and now she's adding in the red. I mean, the, the red and the yellow makes sense because usually people's undertones are usually uh -huh, like uh -huh. a reddish or yellow right. tone. You know, you know. I know some things. So we matched you to a neutral undertone, so that means you're gonna have a good amount of red and yellow okay. in your wow. shade. Also, you guys, they took my shade off of Instagram, so yeah. I have so many different filters. So it was like, hard. it'll be very interesting to see which one you picked. Yeah. <laughs> Did I pick a good one? Okay, so next we're gonna roller mill, and we're gonna use some of our oil phase to wet out the pigments and to mill. Mm. Dude, it looks like Lion King. 
<laughs> Ooh, the mixing. The mixing. Ooh, oh my god, that is so aesthetically pleasing. Mm. This is baking. This is it's like we're making brownies. Like that's what it's that. Right? Good thing we already ate lunch. I know. That shrimp looks like chocolate, yep. right? Dessert time. Dessert time. <laughs> All right, you guys ready to roll our bread? Yes. Are you ready to eat it? <laughs> So this is our roller mill, and what we're gonna do is we're just going to break up all of those chunks and yeah. agglomerates. Ooh, this is mm -hmm. gonna be good. And we're breaking those oh down. My god. Oh my god. Yep. That's so oh. satisfying. Oh my god, that's uh -huh. so satisfying. So what this machine is doing is crushing any like bumps of pigments that are in the formula right now, and it's crushing them to a really fine dust so that the formula is now homogenous. And so Ooh. if you were to swatch it, you just see one color instead of a mix of black and white, white and yellow yeah. peeking through. It's making me frown because it's so aesthetically pleasing. Isn't it? You know how when you dance and it's good and you just <laughs> bust out a mug? We roller mill three times. Okay. We want to get the particle size to five microns. So really, really, really small. And it takes about three times. So we just did our first pass and we just kind of scrape it in. I don't know why I love that type of stuff. The scraping and the thinning and the pouring. And now we're doing our second pass. Now you guys know why this is my favorite part. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Now we are adding our color grind phase to our oil phase. Ooh, I can't wait to see this drip into there. Ooh, yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, there's oil stuff at the mm -hmm. bottom. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's interesting how it just sits on top. They just separate, right? See, this is what they should have taught us in chemistry. Right? How to mix concealers yes. and foundations. Yes. Now our color grind is mixing in with our oil phase. And we're just cool. going to let that mix for a little bit. Very cool. <laughs> Very cool. Wow. Okay, next, next we're gonna add in our powders. They add slip to the formula and they really help slip. give that soft blurring effect. I want my under eyes to be as soft yes. as possible. Listen. I wanna look 12 by I wanna look out of focus. I wonder who comes up with all the formulas. Melody does. Like you, but like you, like writing it out, like this yeah. is what it should yeah. include. She creates uh -huh. it. Those are masterminds. Mm -hmm. That's mm -hmm. insane. Now that we have our oil phase, our color grind, and our powders mixing in, we are going to add our water. You guys want to do some of this? Yes. Okay. Drop it in slowly with the pipette. It's a great word. I was gonna say pipette. 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 So is the water thinning it out? Is that what we're doing? It's actually thickening it. So water you'll start to see it? the mm -hmm. formula raise in the beaker. Ooh. It's really cool. Oh. There we go. So we Pouring add it slowly it. because oil and water are not compatible. Right. So what we're doing is we're making them compatible and you do that by adding it very slowly. You're forcing them to get along slowly. Yeah. Look how thin and, she is. Yeah, and the color is a, a little bit different than what we saw in the color yeah. grind. So thick that everybody else in the room is so uncomfortable. <laughs> So now we've filled our syringe with the bulk that we just made, and we're gonna fill a vial. Yay! You know what, this, this takes me back to a dark memory. When I was little, my dad thought I had pneumonia, and I had to go to the doctor, and they had to give me a shot of penicillin up my butt with one of those, and guess what? That was the day I learned I was allergic to penicillin. And on that note, <laughs> concealer! That is so cool. It was like the exact, I was like waiting for it to fill, and it did, wow. And then we just pop in our wiper, very important that the wiper is in the package because if you insert your applicator without a wiper, it's gonna have so much product uh, yes. on it and it's not gonna be clean. That's cute as heck. Wow. Hi. We did that. You did that, but we were there. Yes. <laughs> Go ahead and swatch on your wrist. Moment of we'll truth. See how it looks. I want to reiterate, this is not their fault if it's not the right color. They went off my Instagram and there's a lot of different hues on there, okay? I'm gonna go here. Okay. Ooh. I mean, that's like really close. Can I blend it? Can yeah, I go ahead? Yeah, yeah. I feel like under your, eye, under your eye, too, that would be uh -huh. nice and yeah. bright. That's yeah. like the perfect color. It's like I do it for a living. <laughs> yeah, so Holy you can see crap. that it blends easily. Wow. It's full coverage. It looks like your skin looks better. I am legitimately shocked because before I found my correct yeah. shade, it took me forever to find a oh, color that matched. And the fact that you did this on the first try, you're better than me and I'm my own <laughs> self. So now we are making Fair 20 neutral for you, which was also color matched off Instagram. So we'll see if it's. Uh, we'll see. see. If I did Sometimes see. she's got a spray she's tan. Good. Sometimes she doesn't. So it's interesting. You can see the difference in the pigments that we use yeah. this time. Yeah. There's less red and less yellow. It blows my mind that it's a powder at first. I know. Yeah. But that literally looks like me in a powder. Wow. 
Wow. Can you rub? That actually really blends. Oh, you're good. The fact that you just eye that. Magic. Magic. We had the most fun. Thank you guys so much for the concealer and the palettes and we everything. Bow down. You guys are hired. <laughs> yes, oh, really. Thank you guys for coming. You guys are the best. Thank we'll you guys. Thank you guys. So I am just. I am verklempt. Verklempt? We're loopy Befuddled. with excitement. First of all, the glasses. We have new merch. Our concealers. Concealers, eyeshadow palettes. Listen, we were gifted. I am so serious when I say that it has been so hard for me to find a concealer. That's why I haven't been using one, because I'm like, nothing works, nothing matches. I don't like the consistency. That one, seriously, was so good. ColourPop just gave us like the best day. They were so welcoming. So nice. Also, what else do you guys want to see us do? Where else should we trip with our beauty? Let us know. Comment yeah. section below. And let us know who's wearing these glasses better. It's obviously Drew, but... Oh, I think you look fantastic. Wait, you guys, but before you go, make sure you click right over there for even more ColourPop action and hit that subscribe button. You know what to do. Uh-huh. Did you do it? <laughs>